three, two, one. Subscribe now, beer.
not my favorite type of video to do. All right, it's a little boring for me. It's just pricing, but I understand the value of it, and that's why I did it. Um, when I, before I came out here, I couldn't get enough of pricing because it helps you formulate a picture of what you're about to step into financially. Uh, you know, when you first get here, you're not really going to be hitting the grocery stores like this, right? You're going to be eating out like I ate out every day. And until I settled in and got a place and got my Thai girl, you know, it, even if I was by myself and had a place, I'd be eating out. And if you find yourself in the position where I'm at, you'll probably be in the grocery store more. You know, I've got a Thai girlfriend cooking for me. So, and you know, she's got her daughter. So it's, I don't know if it's cheap or not. To eat, to eat at home or eat out. I'm gonna say it is because I go to markets and if you buy things local and try to stay away from the imports, it's, it is cheaper. But as you can see with a lot of pricing in this video, I try to hit a lot of the imports also um, to give you an idea, because those are things you're familiar with back home, the, these type of products, right? You may not understand what you're looking at with some of the Thai products until you've been here. And then you'll slowly transition to some of these homegrown products that you like, or you know, you're gonna stick with your Western stuff, I don't know. But I've switched quite a bit to market stuff here. And you know, I mean, I freaking eat water buffalo and it's fantastic. Uh, you know, certain things are pretty reasonable, certain imports can be a little pricey. So, Anyway, without further ado, we're gonna cut this one. We'll do a part two, so check for a second video of more pricing. Come and fly away with me. Come and fly away with me. Come and fly